Number 5 Amanda Nunes is the current UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion. She recently defeated former champion Ronda Rousey by TKO in the first round. At UFC 207, Amanda Nunes recently mentioned that she was interested in moving up to the new UFC Women's Featherweight division and challenge for the title. Both Holly Holm and Jermaine Durandamy are fighting for the vacant UFC Featherweight title at UFC 208. I believe the winner of that fight facing off against Amanda Nunes would be a huge fight and would definitely be interesting to see later this year. Number 4 Michael Bisping is the current UFC middleweight champion. He last successfully made his first title defense, defeating Dan Henderson by a unanimous decision at UFC 204. Just recently, Tyron Woodley challenged Michael Bisping to a fight. Michael Bisping was happy to accept the challenge, but due to a lot of deserving challengers in both of their divisions waiting for their title shots, this fight will not happen anytime soon. But it would be interesting to see who would come out on top. Number 3 Demetrius Johnson is the current UFC flyweight champion. He last successfully made his ninth title defense, defeating Tim Elliott by a unanimous decision at the Ultimate Fighter 24 finale. Demetrius Johnson is the most dominant champion on the current roster. He has defeated all of his opponents relatively easily and is one win away from breaking Anderson Silva's record of 10 consecutive title defenses. I believe it will be interesting to see a matchup between Demetrius Johnson and the newly crowned UFC bantamweight champion Cody Garbrandt. Both fighters are on different levels and it will be interesting to see how Demetrius Johnson would do going back to the bantamweight division. Hopefully this fight happens later this year. Number 2 Jose Aldo is the current UFC featherweight champion. He last defeated Frankie Edgar by a unanimous decision at UFC 200 to become the interim UFC featherweight champion and later became the official champion. A matchup Jose Aldo has been campaigning for is a rematch with current UFC lightweight champion Conor McGregor who he lost his title to in just 13 seconds of the first round at UFC 194. Ever since that loss, Jose Aldo has been chasing Conor McGregor for a rematch and is even willing to fight him at lightweight. But Conor McGregor doesn't seem very interested. It will be interesting interesting to see how the second contest would go between both fighters at lightweight and I hope we get to see it in 2017. Number 1 Tyron Woodley is the current UFC welterweight champion. He last faced Stephen Thompson at UFC 205 where the fight was ruled a majority draw. He is scheduled to face Stephen Thompson again in a rematch at UFC 209. If Tyron Woodley is successful in defending his title, I believe a fight between Tyron Woodley and Conor McGregor would be huge. Both fighters had numerous altercations leading up to UFC 205 and it gained massive amounts of attention. With both fighters willing to fight each other, hopefully the UFC can make it happen later this year. If this fight happened who do you guys think would win this fight let me know your thoughts in the comment section below thank you